Eddie Collins and I were working on the Dayzetta sinkhole back in 2008. This is a sinkhole that collapsed in the town of Dayzetta, which sits on a salt dome northeast of Houston, a few tens of miles. We were trying to determine whether there was any further risk of collapse with that sinkhole, which happened to be located across the highway from the, the high school there in Dayzetta. And so we had a, a gravimeter out there and we were trying to get as close to the sinkhole as we could to see whether we could find any void spaces underneath that might collapse. And so on about the second day of data collection, we were probably 50 feet from the edge of the sinkhole and we had the gravimeter sitting there on the ground. It's a really sensitive instrument. And it had been very stable the whole time we'd been collecting these measurements, but suddenly the measurements were just going wild. The whole instrument went crazy. And so we're thinking, oh no, is the, is the sinkhole about to collapse underneath us? And, and this was a sinkhole that was in a marshy area. So when it collapsed, lots of water flowed into the sinkhole and even some alligators were in there. So we're thinking, here we are, gonna be floating in the water and the alligators are gonna come for us. So we picked up the instrument, moved it a few feet away and, and uh, record, tried to record it again. And again, it was the same thing. We were getting all these crazy readings from it. And, after a couple of minutes, they, they went away and thinking about it throughout the day, what that might have been, I looked at the earthquake reports for the day and sure enough, you know, there was an earthquake in Iceland, a magnitude six plus that occurred you know, about 20 minutes before we had seen those weird measurements on our gravimeter. So that's what we were seeing.